Hi, my name is Nikki Kennedy, and I'm a Senior Insights Manager at Glambia Nutritionals. My work focuses on the sports nutrition, supplements, and early life sectors. I've been with Glambia for over 10 years, and I work in the Madison, Wisconsin office. I'm excited to be here today to talk to you a little bit about some trends that we're seeing post-COVID. As we are all very well aware, COVID has had a significant impact on health and wellness categories globally. One of the areas where I think it has had a particularly large impact has been the nutritionally focused on the go product space. Brands were doing a great job to deliver innovative boundary pushing products to those consumers who lived a busy lifestyle. Either they skipped lunch and needed a good tasting bar to have at their desk, or perhaps they needed a shake to get them from the gym to the office on their commute. Whatever the occasion, the pandemic brought those on the go moments to a halt. With many more people at home, we saw a shift in products that were nutritionally focused to be a little bit more indulgent, incorporate those indulgent flavors that consumers were looking for to comfort them without sacrificing nutrition. Immune health is something not only supplement brands are asking about, but everyone is talking about. Which makes sense because consumers are much more concerned with their immune health than they were pre-pandemic. According to a survey by FMCG gurus, 61% of Europeans indicate that they're more conscious of their immune health as a result of COVID-19. Globally, that number is even higher. According to the same survey, between April and July of this year, the percentage of consumers who indicated they were more conscious of their immune health grew by 7%. In terms of immune-supporting ingredients in Europe, iron is most commonly associated with immune health, followed by vitamin C and A. In more recent surveys done by FMCG gurus post-pandemic, we also found that protein has a very strong association to immune health as well. According to that survey, 72% of Europeans indicated that they associate protein with boosting their immune health. In terms of trends to look forward to in 2021, there are two trends that I'm anxious to see play out in the next year. The first one is what analysts are calling smart nutrition, or what I would describe as a more personalized, holistic approach to health and wellness. I expect to see this early on in the year, as we generally do in terms of health and wellness, see a bump as consumers start off their new year looking to get that healthy lifestyle back after a holiday period. I think the impact of that is just going to be exemplified based on us being in the pandemic for so long. So as the pandemic lifts, I expect consumers to look to get back to those healthy lifestyles. And that's definitely supported by surveys that we've seen that indicate three hours out of four European consumers are looking to eating more and drinking more healthfully in the future. The second trend that I'm looking forward to seeing play out is that associated with cognitive benefits like mood, stress, and sleep. We've seen in recent surveys that one in five consumers in Europe have become more conscious of their mental health since the pandemic. And so I expect to see products that follow up around that trend in the next year. My favorite Glambia Nutritionals ingredient is True Cal. Not only is it a fantastic ingredient, a great source of calcium from milk that's balanced perfectly with all the trace minerals that you need to develop strong bones, but it was also the first project that I worked on at Glambia, so it holds a special place in my heart. My favorite Glambia Nutritionals location that I visited so far has been the Shanghai office. 
only for the fact that I got to go all the way to China and discover and learn about a whole new culture and meet all of the wonderful people that work in that office. It's just an amazing location with an amazing view, and so it's one that I'll never forget. One of my new favorite products that I've recently discovered has been the Ritual Multivitamin, specifically made for women. Um, it's a fantastic product. It's like a capsule within a capsule. It smells fantastic, even though it's a capsule. But one of the things that I think is really interesting to me is that it comes with a little packet that talks about all of the individual ingredients and why you need them and where they're sourced from. So that's what really stood out for me, where they came from as some someone who's in the ingredient space, those sources are really interesting. And so that's been my favorite, the Ritual Women's Multivitamin.